State percentage of five and six mark this year for the young man who's uniform with the old style Hershey Bear logo on the front. Here's Rod Pelly making his at home debut. Knocks it into the slot area, taken out by Boyd Kane, brought back by the Bears to the near side wing, and there's a shot from the wall. And a save off the glove of Eagle back down near the corner. Matt Polk for the Bears is there on it. Gets it off to McNeil behind his net. Lost the handle. Maroon trying to walk out in front. Look at the backhand one home. It went off his stick and then deflected it. Dug off the wall by Barlow, though. Set a hit to DeSalvatore. Drops it back to Barlow with a shot. To save by Bobkoff. Bad rebound in front. Tape ends up handing it off to DeSalvatore, who gets knocked down to the ice by Kurtz and a rolling puck is then jumped on by Bob Kong. The fling in back beyond the goal line. Gannon nudging it around to Bodie. Bodie trying to play that puck out, had it knocked away, picked up top of the ring, shot on goal, save made with Patoni putting it right in on Bob Kong. Former member of the Big Red, played away. One minute remaining to the period. And a minute to go in the period as Hershey comes back into the Atwell zone. Right side ring, centering feed, backdoor tap in goal. TJ Siner takes the backdoor feed from the right ring by Zach Campbell. And the Bears here in the closing minute of period one. Send it Marshall down in front of the net, but the Atwells nudge it away. Carried out in Rosehill, dumps it all the way down the ice. Back behind the net, puck almost fumbled away by Holpe. There's a scramble, puck knocked into the net as it comes off the moorings. Red light came on, but looked like that goal had been dis the view that the official gets down there. And taking a very, very long look at this. Looks like the determination has been made. The referee steps out. And now he'll have a quick word with the uh, respective captains, Nate Geddon of the Atlas and Boyd Kane of the Bears, and the signal given, no goal. In 2009 and 2010, then here are the Atlas behind the net. Holland centers in front. He's got Paul Mary who rifles it home. Perfect pass, perfect shot. Holt they rank dead last in the AHL in shots per game. But they're playing an Orphic team tonight that's been giving up quite a few shots. Here are the uh, Atlas with a steal and a Bodhi feed. Big kick around here to the near side. De Salvatore putting it back beyond the net. Barlow again, Scamper's right ring, throws it down low. It's deflected off a skate and then chipped into the net as John De Salvatore has put the Bears back in front. A centering feed looked like it hit a leg or a skate. And 1237 of the second. Here's Cowan down the left side wing. A shot for the circle is wide. Played back out high slot. Driving shot score. Patrick McNeil from the blue line. High slot through traffic. Eight Rose Hill, two minutes for elbowing. Time of penalty, 253 of the third. All right, here come the Bears working in front. Here's a redirection shot to Salvatore. And a nice save by Bobkoff. Boy, that was a beautiful pass. Here along the left side wing, Bears can't clear, get on a driving shot, and that one wide of net, held in by Gensel, left side point, his shot tipped, and a score! A game Gensel shot is tipped in. Brandon McMillan. Looked like McMillan got a stick on it, and the Atlas are back within one. So nice, little, uh, nice little touch there, little redirection. Oh, maybe not, it might have went off the Hershey guy, huh? Yeah, watch, watch a replay. McMillan's stick was there. We saw the stick. Of the Here's Edom from center. Hustles in. Puts it behind the net. Sends it there to a man trying to wrap it around as Maroon. Save made. Rebound. Wrap around other side by Edom. Another stop by Holtby. Rebound behind the goal. Bears Boyd Kane to the Atwell zone with a shot. Right on. Middle of the ice. Save made. Rebound white wall. Patoni puts it behind the net. Centered out in front. Shot score. Bottom of the right ring. Garrett Mitchell of Hershey off a beautiful feed from behind the goal line and the Bears with some breathing room with 3.27 to play. Here come the Atwells charging with 2.18 remaining. Here they come, right point, shot on goal and Paul Mary puts it right in the glove and Holpe plays it back out, picked up at center, racing ahead, here's Jeff Tate to the line, he'll drop it back for DeSalvatore, he'll backhand it to the empty net with 21 seconds to play. And back in goal, Atlas have it back beyond their own goal line, and that is going to do it, so. Igor Bobkoff and the Atlas come up shy. A 5-2 pair win, and the Atlas losing streak hits six consecutive games.